I like that too. So this gray on the left black dots on over my face. Okay guys, so really quick, I just want to show you my outfit. and welcome to another vlog. I always feel like I'm starting in the car all the time because I'm always rushing. Girl, because I'm always rushing. So I always feel like I'm starting in the car. So anyway, y'all, we are on our way to meet Portia for lunch. I have not seen my girl in a minute, y'all. It's, it's really, I don't even remember the last time. Who is that? Somebody just rolled past there blowing the horn like crazy. I don't know who that was, hey girl. Uh, but anyway yeah so we're going for Mexican y'all know I'm not a Mexican fan but um, the place that we're going to is really nice and just for aesthetic purposes <laughs> um, we're going and then I think it's nice outside I don't know because I got straight in the car from the garage but according to the weather app is nice outside so I thought it would be like nice um because it's by the water so I thought it would be nice for us to like sit outside you know and um by the water and stuff so anyway yeah so that's what we're heading to I don't know where this day is going to lead us y'all I remember I was telling y'all that I was working on a project for a brand so I just started that like today literally so <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. Between that and spring break, y'all, I don't know. I don't know what, what the day is going to lead, where the day is going to lead us. So, anyway, I will see you guys when we get there. Y'all, look at this. Ah! That's Portia over there. Little Portia. Hey, y'all. <laughs> Look at your drink, Craig. Girl. Yes, I'm excited. I wish it was super sunny out here, like we on an island somewhere. That part. Oh, we gonna be on one soon. You got that So, oh. Oh, that's Christian. Let me get a picture of my drink. It looks like I'm in the island with this. Ooh. Fantastic. You want to sip on these? Have a little chips and dip some little things. Which one mine? These or yours? Which one mine? What was that about? Oh, shit. <laughs> what shape will my sister have for today? They look decent, man, because I had the gold. Okay, yeah. Um, well, I'm ready to order. Okay, go ahead. Start with her. Can I get the, um, the chicken fajita? Chicken fajita. Yes, no guacamole. No guacamole. No beans. No beans, no guacamole. What's the lime cream or what is that? She like that. That's the okay. stuff you get there. Okay, that I like that. <laughs> That's the stuff you get. <laughs> okay, I like that. That's that sauce you get so, when you go to the You said uh, no beans on the chicken pita and then no... No beans and no guacamole. No guacamole. Mm, no guac. Mm -hmm. I, do not, I don't like the texture of guac. Really? So we had a chicken fajita, no black beans, and then no guac. Uh, 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 you know what I was going to say. No matter, I don't want it on my plate. All right, I'm going to have the steak fajita. You said the steak fajita? Yeah. Right. I'm going to try some different. Um, so the rice, is it white rice or is it brown rice? Uh, it's kind of like oranges. <laughs> it's Mexican rice. Yeah, Mexican rice. Do y'all have white rice? I... Let me see if I can put that in. If y'all have it, I'm gonna wipe my right Y'all hear that, um, the music? Yeah. Like we on a, a island. Yeah. <laughs> but I'll take everything else. Ooh, that's good. Yeah, see if they got white rice instead of that Mexican rice. I'm gonna talk to the kitchen. <laughs> I'm gonna slam. What happened? I thought a bird just shit on me. Stop hitting me on my head. No. No. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Make sure you never fall. I'm looking at top
Friday. Oh, it is Friday. Mm -hmm. I thought it was. It feels like a Saturday. Hi. It does. Hello. Hi. Hi. Here you go. All right. It's a beautiful day, though. And y'all look at the water. Look at the dirty water. <laughs> look at the dirty water. <laughs> Is this the James? The James, honey. Dirty. All day. Yeah. What else they building down here? Nothing. Okay, this would be nice if they put a photo shoot. I feel like they do do photo shoots out here. Givenchy. <laughs> yes, honey. Now she about to run. <laughs> That's what it's giving. <laughs> hey guys, so it's the first day of spring break. Yay. Yay. Um, we're actually on our way to the movies. Y'all can come here if you want to. We're actually on our way to the movies. So, um, well, <laughs> say hi, Josiah. Hi. So, um, yeah, I'm just putting my shoes on so we can head out. And we'll probably grab lunch at the movies because this is the theater where you eat at. Um, with the recliners and stuff. I love this theater. Actually, this is the only theater I go to. So, yeah. Oh, Christian. Come get the wipes, I forgot. So I like to wipe down the seats. Come get the wipes. Under the sink, I think, I hope. Um, so yeah, anyway, there's Zoe. What's up, y'all? So we're getting ready to head on out. I'll see y'all at the movies. What are we going to see? Hollywood Eerie, Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu Panda. All right, <laughs> see y'all there. Y'all tell me why this boy is laid back. Like you saw nothing. In the bed. It's anger! Let me out of In years, this is my last chance to win. Just like you. I feel so uh, famous dog. Good, it's baby. even worse than the rest of you. This isn't the route on the map. It's okay. Just follow Arthur. Lead the way, King. Okay, guys. So we are at Lowe's. I don't know if I told you guys or not, but I think I did, that I am in the process of switching out my son and my daughter's room. We're moving her downstairs since she's in college and moving him upstairs. Um, and then I'm also doing his room and her room. Her room is after I do these two rooms. So yeah, anyway, we're at Lowe's to pick out paint colors. Um, and I've got my oldest with me, so he can kind of give me his input on what he thinks about some colors that I have in my head. So, yeah. Hello? Okay, so I'm thinking I'm doing like an accent wall in his room. Um, we talked about black for sure. Oh, this caviar is pretty. This caviar is pretty. Um, so, Y'all know I like to take the colors home and look at them on Pinterest to get a true, um, a true vision of the color. So, an, or an accurate vision of the color. So, that's what we're gonna do. Christian, I was thinking of something like this. Like this color here. What do you think about that? So it's not really gray, but it's not. I think it's, it's an accent color, not as a, not the whole room, but just as an accent color. Well, the rest of the walls would like, still be white. So we could do like a cream yeah. or we could do like a, a soft gray almost still. Okay, so, ooh, take this one, the caviar, yeah. So repost gray is the color I have in my office. So that's like a light silver almost. It's gray, but it's, it's got like a, a, a silver undertone almost. Um, so this one is a nice neutral. I have modern gray in my bedroom, but I don't see modern gray. I only see modernist gray. And I don't think that's the same thing. 
Not unless they change the name. So. I like this caviar. You like the caviar? And I think that caviar is given black, but it might actually be brown. But, but see, okay, so this is what I was thinking. Actually, I like this web gray too. Cause it's giving a hint of that green. It's got like a green undertone as well. It's web gray. Um, okay, so take these two. But we would need to find some walls. I mean some walls. We would need to find some paint that's going to um, complement that as an accent wall. That one or that one. I was, I think I was leaning towards like that as an accent wall. Not really that. Either that or this one. The, like something like that as an accent wall. So how do you feel about these? these colors. Let me show y'all a little bit like this color or this middle one. So how do you feel about how do you feel about those colors as an accent wall? So it would be the wall that your bed is on. I like, what color is my bed? Black. Your bed is gray. It's a light gray. Okay. Here, I'll show you. We'll find a light gray one. You can put it on top and that'll show you. Okay, I know, but it's kind of like gray. Like, mm, I don't know if it's this. Like, it might be like this gray matters. So that's what that would look like, or like that. We already know it's gonna look good up against black. Or do you just want to do black as an accent? I think I just want to do black. Cause like I already have a bluish, grayish in my current room. That was like grayish blue. You had navy in your room. That's not the yeah, same. That is navy. The wall is not navy. You, I'm talking about the wall. Yeah, your wall was gray. That's what I just said. I said the bed was blue and the wall was already a gray. Right, but that's color. not. But that's not blue. I mean, it is, but it's not. I don't know what color it is. I mean, I get what you're saying, but it's not the same. It's still not the same. I still like that black. Like, uh, Okay. Well, we need to find some accent colors. Let me see. Put. Oh, I like that stone out. Like that stone out. That looks nice together. And it looks good with the black, too. I like those. Okay. Okay, y'all. So, we're going to look up the colors on. Hey, y'all behave yourself. We're gonna look up the colors on Pinterest so we can get a better idea of what they actually look like. So we'll start with the caviar. So that's what that looks like. Oh, that's a, yeah, that's really pretty. That's really pretty. <laughs> I like that too. Cause it's not really black. It's like a dark, 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 yeah, dark, it has a dark. Blue undertone. Yeah, like a dark gray with a blue under like that is really pretty. I like that. Okay, so that's caviar. What's the other one I said I wanted to look at? Slate. Slate tile. How green to the See, it's got like a green undertone to it a little bit, but that's it's. But you see it up against the gray. Mm -hmm. It's nice up against the gray. <coughs> like really nice. All right, let's look at modernist gray and no, what I say, stone owl. It may not have stone, and nobody bought stone now. I don't see it on here. That's very pretty. I like that. All right, so let's get, yeah, I like those two together for sure. 
I even like these two together. So let's get a sample. I'm gonna get a sample of caviar, stone owl, and modernist gray. Um, oh, and I wanted to look up web gray because I like web gray too. So let's look up. This web gray. So it's like a dark gray. It's not really giving that blue undertone like I thought. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, here it is. So this is web gray. This one is yeah. nice too. All right, but you know for sure that you want black. Yes. All right. Okay, so we're going to just get these samples and see what happens. <laughs> so don't mind me, I know I look rough. Y'all, I had my last infusion today. Hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. So I am moving kind of slow. I'm still very like groggy from the cocktail that they gave me, but yeah, um, I'm in here. I just did the swatches for my son's new room. And um, I wanted to share them with you guys. I'm hoping that it picks up on camera because it's very gloomy outside. I think it's about the storm, actually. So it's not as bright in here as I would like it to be. Um, but the goal is to have a painter come tomorrow. So I wanted to show you guys this before the painter comes. I still not decided I still haven't locked in on a particular color yet um, it's between two but I will show you guys what I'm thinking or what I'm looking at um, also don't mind my daughter's room because we're moving her out so it's stuff everywhere and yeah it's chaos in here basically and I'm trying to get her furniture and stuff out of here tonight so that the painter can come tomorrow we're just waiting on some quotes um, but let me tell you something. <laughs> if they try to beat us in the head, I'm definitely going to be painting this myself. Okay. But um, I don't like painting, but I will if I have to. I have really literally painted my entire house except for a couple of um, rooms. So I, I will do it if I have to. Don't try to beat me in my head. Don't sleep on me because <laughs> I will get out here and I will paint. Okay. But anyway, um, what was I saying? So... Hold on, y'all. I got to clear some space. Okay. So, yeah, I'm going to make this fast, y'all, because I'm supposed to be going to see the Tina Turner play with one of my girlfriends. So, I need to hurry up and speed this up so I can go get dressed. But I wanted to show you guys the colors. So, I'm going to show you her room because it is what it is, okay? So, anyway, this is the chaos, okay? <laughs> this is the chaos. Um, But, anyway, let's look at the colors. So, this gray on the left here is called Sher it's Sherwin Williams Stone Owl. And then this one on the right is Sherwin Williams Modernist. So, this one on the right is giving more of a taupey color. Um, This one is more of a true gray. It's kind of giving silver almost um and i do like that but it's still a little bit too dark from what i was what i was envisioning it will work right but it's still a little bit too dark so what i think i'm going to do is i'm just going to have him do one coat of that so that it doesn't come off as dark um if i go with that color or i do like the the modernist as well um but i don't know how i feel about it um with oh hold on y'all sorry i forgot i zoomed in Ooh. um i don't know how i feel about it with the gray bed in here so because i don't want it to i just don't want it to um get why i don't want it to be washed out if that makes sense like i don't want the bed the bed is going to pop because it's going to be up against the black wall but the rest of the room would be that other color and i don't know i just don't want it to kind of like run together if that makes sense so 
yeah um i kind of i'm kind of in between because even even though i like the lighter one over here um hold on let me zoom y'all in again i think i'm thinking about going with the color that i have around my house actually uh just because so yeah i really i really don't know y'all i'm up in the air it's between this one and the and the color that i have around my house which is oh i'm gonna insert it for y'all because i can't think of the name of it but yeah so it's between those two now that one the one that's around our, our house depending on which way the light comes in it can definitely come off more of a uh true white or it could come off as like a light 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 i'm talking about like a pale gray color um almost silvery okay so i do love that and that is what i pretty much want um what i was thinking in my head but i do like this other color as well i just don't i i know for sure i don't know let me not say that i don't think i want to go too dark in here because i don't want i just don't want it to feel heavy you know so um because even with my son's furniture you know by him having i mean it's by him being a boy the way his room is going to be decorated is going to be masculine you know so i don't want it to feel too heavy in here um so yeah that that's where that's basically and it's so crazy because just looking like glancing at it it really looks like it could be the same color but they're really not the and this black i also want to say this black has a red undertone i see some red in there which is i didn't expect that <laughs> but i definitely see some red in there um but it's really a pretty black and it's the caviar. It was between that one and the tricorn black, which is a true black. And that is the black that I have downstairs. Um, but I do like I do like this black. So anyway, just stay tuned, y'all, because I will be doing a whole makeover for this room um, with his stuff. It's probably going to be a slow process, though, because I'm still picking out furniture. Um, but yeah, so anyway i need to go get dressed so i'll see y'all in a bit okay guys so really quick i just want to show you my outfit so i'm wearing this black blazer from zara this black bodysuit from amazon um it's like the wolf it's a wolf for dupe for half or more than that off um and then these uh bronze uh trousers that i got they are some cargo trousers but they're like this satin material and i got these from target and i posted them a while ago i linked them a while ago if i can find them i'll link them again but yeah that and then these um sandals that i wear with everything y'all they are so beat up but i love them because they're so comfortable i got them from asos a couple of years ago they actually look like the christian louboutins um so yeah, they're like a dupe, but that is what they look like on with the pants. Really cute, chic, classy, sexy, all of those things. And then I'm carrying um, this bronze, that Bottega sort of bag. Um, I don't remember where I got this from, y'all. I really don't. <laughs> but if I can find it, I'll make it for you guys. But yeah, this is the fit. So um, scent is Jador by christian dior um this necklace i got from zara a while ago and my shades are desi so yeah that's the look
Hey guys, so we're back home and um, I'm getting ready to take all this off and get ready. Um, my hubby made me some see y'all. It's got, because it's very cold outside and I had all this exposed, even though I was pulling my jacket, you know, across my chest, I could still feel like the wind coming through. And I was like, oh, I do not want to get sick. <laughs> So he made this for me, y'all don't get, I don't know what it is. It's got some natural herbs in it and some honey. I, that's all I know. And y'all know it's the heart mug. Anyway, um, yeah, so we're getting ready to, I guess, undress, un, what is it? Unwind? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But... I wanted to come on here and talk to y'all about the, the play. So, the play was actually, okay, I don't know. I don't know how to word it, okay? Because my friend and I, we could not put our finger on it. <laughs> we couldn't put our finger on it. But it was like, it was giving very much like, because it's supposed to be like an off-Broadway play. And so, it was giving very much like um, high school play. You know, I don't know. I don't know how else to say it, okay? It was, let me wash my hands. It was giving very much high school play. Um, and the story was all over the place. So, y'all, I didn't know that Tina, well, not Tina, anime, honey. <laughs> I didn't know, I didn't know that anime had, well, in the movie, I think it did show that she had a son before. I, uh, before she married Ike, I think. But I didn't know that she was um, seeing somebody else within the, the band before she got with Ike. And then the way they made the play scene, because this is all based off of the book, okay? Not the movie, but the book. The way the play made it seem... They made it seem like they never even fell in love. Like it was more like, um, like you know, in the movie, it was more like a connection because you know they did a thing or whatever, and then it was like she fell in love or whatever, right? But in the play, they made it seem like he was just like, oh, um, we can be famous together. Like you know, there's no Ike without Tina. Tina with no Ike. So we should just go ahead and get married. Cause she was like, I'm looking at, I look at you like my, my big brother. So I was confused by that. Really confused. <laughs> because I thought that it was a thing of them like falling in love, you know? And um and getting married. That's what I thought it was. Even though, you know, he we all know how he was. But anyway. So that part confused me. Um what else confused me? They did go into her after Ike. Um, what's the word I'm trying to say? Y'all, I am tripping. Why am I using toner? Oh my god, I'm tripping. I am tripping. <laughs> I was really using my toner, not my makeup remover. Anyway, um. They went into that part of her life when, y'all, when I say, oh, my makeup was looking flawless tonight. I used a couple of new products and it was looking good, y'all. It was looking good. I mixed, well, not really new products, but what I did was I mix, mixed a lot of stuff. Matter of fact, let me show y'all what I did real quick. Because it was a game changer. It was really a game changer. Hold on, y'all. So y'all know I ordered this stuff from Fancy, right? So I usually use the, the Charlotte Tillsbury, um, I forget what it's called, but it's the um, contour stick that I usually use. But I said I was gonna try the Fancy one. So what I did was, y'all know I used the Makeup by Mario, right? So I mixed these two. And I use the eavesdrop. I normally just use the eavesdrop when I'm just trying to do something light, like a makeup, no makeup day. I normally use the eavesdrop for that, but I mix these two together. Came out flawless, right? And then um, for my concealer this time, 
I use the Fenty, um, this is number 300, so this is the lighter one. I use that like right here in the corner, like only like right here, right? And then I took my um, NARS one, which is actually more my complexion, it's like a darker one. It's more, I use it for more like color correcting and stuff. I put this like on the corner, so I kind of blended it out to like right here. It looks so good, y'all. And then I used the Fenty powder. Love this stuff. This is the Pro Filter Fancy Powder in Banana. Love it, right? And then, I think I said this already, but I don't know. But I used this as the contour stick. This was my first time using this, and I really love it. It's very smooth. It's the Mocha, Mocha 03. That's the number that I used, and I love how natural it is. I could go up a shade darker, so um, I might try a shade darker, um, but this one was nice as well. So yeah, I really liked it. Like it came out so good, y'all. I gotta clear some space, hold on. So yeah, y'all, like I was saying, that combination was a game changer. It really was. So highly, highly recommend that. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, back to the play. So y'all, the very end, the very end was like Broadway. Like it was giving Broadway, right? The finale, basically. It was definitely giving Broadway. And I was like, okay, this is what we paid our money for. <laughs> okay. But the, even like the singing, like I felt like the singing was off. Like, huh. So the, they had two actresses playing Tina. The first one was like, she was basically giving soprano. And we all know Tina is not a soprano. Okay. She's not. Or she wasn't. Very much an alto. So, but what was crazy was the one, okay, so there was Tina and then it was like the scenes with her mother. Her mother was singing and her mother sounded like Tina Turner. So I was confused. I was like, I think they got the wrong person playing. <laughs> playing Tina Turner. And then the second half, they did like the older, you know, after she left Mike, I mean Mike, Ike, and all of that. And that's when like the one that sounds like Tina Turner, or maybe she was another actress, um, I don't know. But she sounded like Tina Turner. No, I'ma say, I'ma say this was a different one from the mother because she sounded way more like Tina Turner than the mother did. The mother sounded like Tina Turner, but this one really sounded like Tina Turner. And I was like, why didn't they just... Because I don't... I, like, even in the movie, Tina was never a soprano. So I'm trying to understand why they thought when she was younger, like, when she first got with Ike, that's what made I want to be, like, create a sound with her because her sound was so unique. So I was confused as to why... And I was like, well, maybe it was an understudy. Like, <laughs> me and my girlfriend was just trying to figure it out. Like, we was like, make it make sense. <laughs> but um, other than that, y'all, other than that, I felt like it was okay. Like, it was okay. But the, the finale was amazing. It was amazing. And I think I got clips. I think, don't quote me, but I think I got clips of that. So y'all will see if I did. Um, I need to refill. Y'all, my bathroom is so disgusting and dirty and it's like, ugh. <sighs> I'll be cleaning it tomorrow, sure. So anyway, yeah. Um, where's my makeup removal? So yeah. That that's pretty much it was long too. It was a long play. Cause we got there, it started at 7.30 and we didn't get out there till 11. So, I mean, it was only a 15 minute intermission. I don't know why my face is breaking out. Well, I do know my face breaking out because I started eating dairy and I, was, you know, I, I don't know what's wrong with y'all. I had started going crazy with the um, sweets. And so I've been eating a lot of ice cream. And that's not like me. I don't eat ice cream like that. But my kids want an ice cream sandwich, y'all, and I've been going crazy. <laughs> I need to chill, and my face is breaking out. And I know it's because of that dairy. I had to give up dairy because my face used to break out so bad. And when I realized it was the dairy, um, I stopped eating it. 
Like I, I still eat butter, and I eat cheese occasionally. But other, I don't drink milk. I don't drink any kind of milk. None. None. So that's why I take vitamin D. So, yeah. I don't know why I got two pimples right here. Y'all can see. Crazy. Crazy. And the moles, honey, the freckles, moles, whatever you want to call them, honey, they are popping up left and right. When I first met my husband, y'all, I don't know if I ever told y'all this story. When I first met my husband, I went and got my moles removed like a week later after we met. <laughs> and he wanted to see me, right? And I had all these black dots on my face because they had to fall off. Like they had to fall. I couldn't mess with them. They had to fall off. As a matter of fact, I'm going to do it again. Because um, they didn't come back for years. So I'm definitely going to get that done again. Um, I like my freckles, but some of them, it's just they're, they're going crazy right now because I'm getting older. They're popping up everywhere. Like they're on my chest, my back, um, under my breast. Like, y'all. <laughs> It's crazy under there, okay? Crazy. Um, and then I have like a tag on my face, like right, right there. That's a tag. These are scars that I need to do something about, but this this is a tag, and I, I want that to go. So anyway, yeah. Um, but I'm gonna get him to tell y'all what he thought me <laughs> black dots all over my face, cause I don't know if I told him or if he just came in the house and saw. I don't remember. So anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and wash my face in the shower and take a shower because I need to, I need to digress, you know. <sighs> <laughs> Thank you.